Hey, what's going on everybody? Servo here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to bring to you the craziest glitch and exploit we have ever seen on Dreamlight Valley. And we just discovered this on stream today. So I'm going to share it with you, of course, because I cover everything there is to do with Dreamlight Valley. Now, if you guys do enjoy this video at all, please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. We have a huge update coming out in just probably about a week or so. I cover Dreamlight Valley from everything from glitches, guides, just all the good stuff. And uh, I would love to have you here around the channel. And also, thank you to everybody for 37,000 subscribers. We just hit that today. You're absolutely amazing. But let's jump right into the video. All right, so we were just doing our weekly reset stream and we came across a uh, submission by Brain over here. So they got 1200 on their rankings and uh, we saw that they had a beautiful Kim Possible submission right here. It's definitely Kim Possible, looks beautiful. Got the side characters, but it didn't register in my head that, that these were Touch of Magic outfits in the front. So then we got down to, was this picture the wrong one that accidentally got submitted here on Discord? Or was there a way to actually submit Touch of Magic in Dream Snaps? And I'm here to confirm and show you how that it's absolutely possible. So how do you do this? It's exactly what you're seeing here. You have to have the Touch of Magic in front of your character. Now I'm not bringing this to everyone's attention so they could like use and abuse the, you know, this because that's not how Dream Snaps is meant to be. Uh, it's It could be, you know, cheating, but it's actually just a warning because I know this information is gonna get out. You know, we were streaming to like 500 people. The information will of course get out there, but it's more of a warning that be careful because one, I don't want this to ruin Dream Snaps. Two, you could get banned for it. If enough people report your submission, you could get banned. And if you get banned, it's up to 30 days. So you're going to miss out on four weeks of Moonstones. So I don't want that to happen to you. So, I mean, that's everyone's decision to do whatever. But also to bring this to Gameloft's attention, I usually don't care about bugs or exploits or glitches or anything like that. If you, you know, you want to use it, whatever. But if it's in, a, in an instance where it's affecting other players and skewing results, then I don't fully agree with that. So hopefully Gameloft sees this video. If you guys like and share this video around, um, I'm sure Gameloft will eventually come across it. But it also makes me curious how quickly they'll be able to fix this because sometimes bugs end up taking a while for them to be able to fix. And we'll have to see how this goes down. So I'm going to show you how to do this. I am on my second account, of course, just because I didn't want to mess around with this on my main account. <laughs> But uh, I put a mannequin back here, right? So I have just a very simple shirt. Got a little strawberry on there. If I'm looking at my character and I do this and I take a picture and I try to submit my dream snap, it's going to say your picture cannot be submitted because it contains touch of magic items. Okay. But if I have the mannequin in front of me and I take a picture and I submit it, it actually submits to Dream Snaps. It will actually allow you to do that. Your picture was submitted correctly. Submissions close in six days. So if I go over here, let's go to, um, yeah, current challenge. So it's this week on Monster Sona. Pretty cool theme, by the way. <laughs> there it is. It's, it's right there. Touch of magic in my submission. That's kind of crazy. So then I thought to myself, well, if that's the case, can you make like a touch of magic carpet or, you know, something like that? So I went ahead and made a furniture piece. Oh gosh, made a furniture piece. We're going to slap it down right here. We got a little strawberry chair and I'm going to take a picture. Boom, submit and it won't let you. So right now, unless there's another workaround, you can't have touch of magic furniture. It's only for mannequins and having touch of magic on the mannequins so just wanted to bring that to everyone's attention and uh i'm sh i i don't know like i said we had 500 people in stream the word's definitely going to get out it's going to get spread on reddit facebook and all that so whether i make this video i don't think it's really going to bring it any more attention to other you know it's already going to get out there 
So at least you guys are aware of if you see a bunch of touch of magic and dream snaps, you're going to know. I do not recommend doing this again. I don't want to see anyone get banned. And I know a lot of members are going to report submissions with touch of magic. And hopefully they can get this fixed by the next update and get everything back in order. But uh, yeah, definitely very interesting bug. And I'm surprised no one has really shared this too much. But it's definitely out there now. And you can, of course, do this with uh, multiple Touch of Magic mannequins or characters in the foreground. So you can set up a shot kind of like they had, you know, that was during the whole superhero week. So they had like their character as a superhero and then you have like henchmen or henchmen. You could do something like that. And uh, this isn't going to work for every dream snap, but I, I feel like if there's a way someone can create a Touch of Magic, like really amazing outfits and they have them here in the foreground, no matter what the theme are, or even this week with like Monsters Inc. theme, People are going to be like, wow, like what the heck is that? They're going to vote on it. And then the results are going to get uh, skewed in a direction that's just not accurate. So hopefully Gameloft gets this fixed. And it, it, I just don't want it to completely ruin Dream Snaps. And they haven't pushed out the update yet. So hopefully they can get this fixed and get it corrected within the next week. That way, it's this isn't an issue for the ongoing weeks and weeks. But that's pretty much it. Uh, like I said, I haven't seen any more like ways around this other than having the mannequins in front of you. So I think as of right now, that's the only option there is. We're going to close out the video with just a little bit of voting because it is a brand new week. But that's all there is on this video for the Touch of Magic in Dream Snaps. And I hope it get fixed. So let's take a look at some voting here. It is Moana's Village. I expect to see lots of incredible submissions this week. I mean, right off the bat, look at this. Look at how cute that is. This community is so talented. That is insane. This one, we got Maui over here. I got to vote for that one. Oh my gosh. I told you voting this week is going to be so, so good. Look at all these. You got Moana. They filled up the photo fully. There's so much going on with that. Um, okay, these are both pretty good. I kind of like the nighttime shot on that one. Ooh, so I'm surprised so many people actually did a room submission for this theme. You know, you think Moana's village, it would be outside her, her house and all that. They got a little Moana figurine over here. Look at all the food, the spread. That is awesome. Got a bar I don't recommend barbecuing inside of a house. I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> Uh, this one's really good. We'll vote for that. Oh, they went with a whole night theme. Okay. Love the background though. This one is, I think, in Moana's house. But it was a decor challenge, so you gotta have some decor going on in your submission. That one's pretty good. Nighttime one? I'm, I'm digging it. Like, I'm really liking these. So, I've noticed that some of these submissions lately have been, like, really low res and it changes the way the game looks. So they could be playing on like a lower, like a laptop or something like that. That's why it looks a little different. It kind of changes the filters and stuff. But honestly, the lower res photos kind of look really good. I usually vote for them. I don't know. I guess maybe it's because it's different than what we normally have. That submission is pretty great. We got selfie mode. I'm kind of enjoying selfie modes. This one's got some random items back there. So we'll vote for this. Uh, oh, their character is too cute. Look at that. They got to get the vote. It's a decor challenge. They got a lot of decor. Their character is perfect. Ooh, this one's beautiful too. They nailed the light. Look how sharp this photo is. Wow. Got to vote for... Oh my gosh. The voting is so good this week. You guys went all out. That is insane. Vote for it. Vote for this. Uh, Sophie, I don't know. Candyland doesn't really scream Moana's Village to me. Love the lighting on this. <laughs> the character's eyes are closed. <laughs> we gotta vote for that one. I love the widescreen. It looks very cinematic. Very, uh, like a cutscene in a game. Mm, this one's pretty good. Oh, these are both beautiful, but this one. This one is really good. Character super cute. They filled this photo up perfectly. Love Moana's boat. Moana's boat actually looks really good in Dream Snaps, and I never noticed that until this week. Uh, I love, I love everything about this photo. Aw, uh, cute, cute, cute. We'll do about 10 more submissions here. Oh my gosh. These are both incredible, but look at this one. What? Okay, I'm really nervous about my ranking this week. This one's incredible too, but this one, come on. All right, we got one. 
two. Ooh, love the lighting. Three. Uh, we'll do four. Five. Six. Jack Skellington, seven. Eight. Our last two. Oh, this one's really good. Love the light. And our last one is going to this one right here. Alrighty, guys. So that's the end of this video. I, go, I hope you guys enjoyed. You guys know what to look out for. I will see you all in the next video. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.